recognizing hormone receptors are found on hematopoietic stem cells and they are, might be involved in cell uh, self renewal or pro proliferation and so LH blockade can lead to these cells to be dormant and be protected from the chemotherapy insults. Uh, it also had been found in preclinical models where mice were treated with lethal dose radiation therapy that they survived after administration of LH receptor antagonists. Our hypothesis was uh, to administer the luprolides, uh, which is a widely used uh, LH agonist in gynecology, and it is used mainly for abnormal uterine bleeding uh, and uh, fertility preservation uh, to see their impact on the, uh, the hematopoietic cell recovery, the long-term blood uh, count recovery, and the, pla the trans platelet and blood uh, transfusion needs. So we aimed uh, at assessing the gene expression of LH receptor on normal and uh, leukemic hematopoietic cells. Uh, we also did a retrospective analysis on all patients who are premenopausal women uh, with, diagnosed with leukemia and receiving intensive chemotherapy. Uh, and we categorized them into patients who received luprolide versus who did not receive luprolides for other reasons, gynecologic reasons. And uh, we analyzed uh, the long-term uh, hematopoietic uh, recovery, including their absolute neutrophil count, platelet count, absolute lymphocyte count, and as well their need for transfusions. We identified around 180 uh, women uh, with acute myeloid leukemia and around 150 uh, women patients with acute lymphoblastic leukemia and uh, we analyzed their long-term uh, blood count recovery uh, and we have uh, found that patients who received luprolide had significantly higher number of platelet counts and uh, a, uh, absolute neutrophil counts uh, at long term. Uh, we also had uh, uh, seen that uh, the, these patients who received luprolide had significantly less uh, platelet and packed RBCs transfusions. Our findings um, uh, need to be validated in a prospective way. We have uh, identified in a retrospective way that the use of Lupron in patients with leukemia receiving intensive chemotherapy can be associated with a improved long-term uh, hematopoietic recovery and less transfusion needs. And uh, this should be validated in a prospective way, uh, including uh, all patients who might receive a chemotherapy that's uh, associated with a severe myelosuppression.